Hey guys, Nick here, and welcome to another episode of Pokemon Six Months. And today, guys, we are going to participate in the Galar Star Tournament. So, uh, yeah. Uh, Nick, if you haven't s settled on a partner yet, yeah, why not take him up with me? Yes, let's do it. All right, let's go, Hop. All right, there we are. All teams have been successfully registered. Very good. We'll register you and Hop as partners. Now then, are you ready to proceed? Yes. All right, let's head to the locker room. All right, me and Hop against Milo, Nessa, Gordy B, Pierce, Barney, Clara, Bead, Peony, Peony, Kabu, Leon, and Ryan. Oh God. And then two mystery guests. All right, Hop. Uh, so, since we're going up against Milo and Nessa, let's, let's go with Rillaboom. I think that's our best bet. Actually, hmm, interesting idea. Let's go with Cinderace. The reason I want to go with Cinderace is because it's Libro ability. So, let's do this. Alright. Team of... Uh, Nick and Hop will be facing off against Team Milo and Nessa. All right, here we go. Here we go. They're right there in front of me, in front of my eyes. Just our luck to be matched up against the champions team in the, uh, round one, eh? Come on, Milo. Don't tell me. Oops, I, I skipped that. Together, I bet we can uh, sweep aside any opponent, even if it is the champion. You can say that again. In that case, I guess I'd better really put my back into it and show off a little. Don't get too confident, mate. Me and my Pokemon have become a lot stronger since the gym challenge. Alright. First things first. Let's pick up some momentum. Here we go. Oh yeah. Going to the classic theme. Here we go. Double incinderate. The water's got my Pokemon energized and happy, Nessa. I'll extinguish any flame that so much as casts a spark near our energy. Here we go. Alright, our team's all ready to go. We'll start off with an elect- Oh! Hop, you are underleveled, my friend. Okay, good. That wasn't directed at me. Electro Ball. Libro. Ha! Boom! And now we're an electric type. Plus emergency exit. Toxipex. Hmm. Steadfast, Speed Rose, nice. It looks like we're gonna have to take turns on who can Dynamax. All right, it's, it's a good thing I'm using a special attack. I don't think that's gonna do anything. All right, Double Edge, nice hit. All right, uh oh, that's fine. Yeah, Hop and I have to take turns on who can Dynamax. Alright, let's try hitting Tox Attacks again. Boom! Look at that. And that's Tox Attacks down. Nice double up, Hop. Alright. Uh no. All right, Glycepod back up. If we can get uh, Nessa's slot down, uh, there goes Double. However, Nessa's gonna be down two Pokemon after this. All right, that's good. There goes Glycepod. Oh, I know who's next. Uh, her Dreadnought should be next, right? 
We're fine. Oh yeah, Zamazenta. All right. Here she goes, Dredna. There it is, boy. All right. I can Dynamax. I'm not going to yet. Uh, let's go with an Electro Ball. Oh, she's not going to Dynamax. Huh. Interesting. All right, taking down Shift Tree. All right. Alright, Galade's getting a little more powerful every second. Alright, Hop, look out. A Charum. Hop can Dynamax, Nessa can Dynamax. Okay, this is scary. If I Electro Ball the Dreadnought, we'll hopefully be fine. Oh boy, this is scary. Uh. Not good, not good. All right, here we go. Electro ball. Ooh, we're close. Hop, that doesn't help. That doesn't help, Hop. Oh, God. Oh, we're screwed, aren't we? Uh. Hmm. All right. That's it for me. Good job, Cinderace. All right. I kind of thought Hop would finish it. Um, oh, well. Rillaboom, you're up next. <sighs> All right. Hit Dreadnought with a four times super effective move. Or not. There goes Zamazenta. All right, Nessa's slot is done. All right, now it's just Milo. That didn't do much, but we should be fine, hopefully. Uh-oh, Solar Beam. That didn't do much. All right, yeah, Nessa's done. Zamazenta's behemoth bash should finish this. Why am I still echoey? There we go, now I'm not. All right. He has one Pokemon left. All right. Draw until we reach victory. It's Flapple. All right. Here we go. Let's beat them into the ground. Rillaboom. Gigantamax. All right. Use Max Strike. Oh, oh boy. Hop nearly finished it. Let's finish it with a Max Strike. And that's that. Boom. That's the first round easily won. 
All right. Yeah, we washed you, you guys clean away. You've cut off your flow before. It even got going. No wonder you're the champion. All right, next we're up against Gordy and B. Ooh. Um. This will be interesting. Gordy and B. Uh, I say Grimmsnarl. I want to just check something real quick. Do I have... Um... Any ground type move that Grimmsnarl can learn? Come on. Earthquake. Nope. Hmm. Um, Earth Power, no. Come on. No. Well, guess not. That's okay, though. We can, we can do this. We can do this without the help of ground type move. Um,. I might lead with Dredna. Or Gallade. We caught Gallade in the last episode to help us with catching Pokemon. Um, we'll probably send it into battle. But I'm going to lead with G-Max Dredna. And I have a reason for this. You'll see. Alright, more battles to come. Nick and Hop. Or Gordian B. Here we go. The two version exclusive gym leaders for some reason. Both of these guys have the coolest designs. What an ideal matchup for letting us both show our strength. Agreed. We couldn't have asked for better options. I will press onward toward victory with every ounce of strength in my body and soul. Between us, we can make a monolith that won't easily be crushed. These two aren't types of opponents we can afford to take lightly. But we're no strangers to being on our a at our A-game. We can do this, mate. It's time for Potswick Dream Team to show what, uh, these people what we can do. Alright. Hey, I'm Shuckle. Good old Shuckle. Alright. Let's use our rock solid moves to crush the willpower of any opponent. Uh, alright. They're going all out. I will too. All right, check this out. Gigantamax. Here we go. Not the smartest idea to lead with normal type pop, I'm not gonna lie, we're going up against a fighting type trainer and you're using a normal type, it's not good. G Max Stone Surge! Alright. Now we got stones floating around here. That'll cause their Pokemon to take damage when they come in. Right? Come on, take damage. Yeah! Alright, that worked. Sand stream. Wait, we're fine with that. That only hurts you guys. Haha. Alright, time for another layer of these. Ow. That was rude. 
We need another layer of these uh, water stones. All right. And Halucha is nearly down. All it takes is one uh, pitfall to beat you. How shall I keep digging? All right, Colossal. Uh, Gordy can Dynamax now, okay. He's gonna Gigantamax, so this is, a, this is gonna be an easy fight. With the two layers, it already took so much damage. This, this is going down easy. It's taking, it's gonna have to take a four times super effective middle. We'll be fine. All right, there goes Halucha. G-Max Stone Surge. And there goes Colossal. All right. And he's sending in Phalanx now. Let's continue the battle. Oh yeah. Uh, we no longer have our Dynamax, but it served its purpose well enough. Phalanx dodged the play rough. Now it's close combat me. Okay, well, good job, Dreadnought. You did what you needed to do. All right. <clears throat> it's Galade's turn now. Psycho Cut. Oh, or hop can handle it, I guess. That's cool. <clears throat> anyway. All right, we're leveling up from this as well. All right, final Pokemon. It's Machamp, right? Yep. No G-Max for you, Machamp. All right, Psycho Cut. Unless Hop beats you, which he did not. All right. Boom. Let's go. He did it. We defeated Gordy and B. All right. I wish you luck in the final round. Show them the same skill you showed to us. All right, Leon and Raihan. This is gonna be tough. Uh, I say we lead with Dreadnought again. No, Grimmsnarl. Huh? Oh, I couldn't eat in time. I'm sorry. Oh, sorry about that. I couldn't mute in time. Ah, no, get off my screen. Ah, uh, oh yeah, that's right. I need to do that. Sorry about that. Uh, had some technical difficulties. So if we lead with Grim Snarl, we have Psychic type moves that we can use. I think that'll be useful. You know. It's time for the final match. Here are the teams that'll be fighting for victory. It's Nick and Hop versus Leon and Raihan. Oh boy, two of the strongest trainers in the region. The eighth gym leader and the former champion. I knew you'd take you would make it through. From the moment I saw the tourney bracket, I knew this was how things would end up, Lee. Haha. <laughs> well then, here we are, facing off in the final round. 
this match will settle who's the strongest team. So let's give it a, all the effort it deserves. I've got to say, I'd rather win this thing by beating you, Leon. But if it means schooling these two, then maybe teaming up with you isn't too bad either. Come on, Nick. We're going to win, even if we have to pry victory right from the hands of Lee's team. Scoring a win together would really make my day, mate. Let's do our best. Here we go. Alright. Theme of the elite leaders being used. That's cool. Alright. Flygon and Aegislash. Ooh. Uh, this isn't the worst, but it also isn't the best. Um, Alright. Definitely not the worst, but not the best either. Do I go for... Oh, we're, we're going for Aegislash first. It's going to do so much damage. Of course. Oh, that was smart. That was really smart. Not only just protecting it from damage, but also allowing uh, Raihan to hit us both. And now my my special attack or, or my yeah my attack fell. Dang it. Um. Darkest Lariat will still do tons of damage to each slash. Oh man, Dubwool's already down. This is bad. This is really, really bad. Here we go, Darkest Lariat. Oh, that did so little. Uh. Steel Beam. Okay, that was bad, but that lowers your health by a lot. The next attack basically kills him. If we land another attack, um... I know. <clears throat> okay, Zamazenta and Dreadnaw. Alright. These two beat B and Gordy pretty well. So here's my idea. We just gotta dig into the uh, right hand spot. Leon didn't shield? Weird. Well, I'll Ice Fang anyway. Alright. Streaming forward, the Sandstorm, huh? All right, all right. I see how it is. Ice Fang. Boom. We took down Flygon. Who's next, Raihan? Gudra? Yep. All right. Dragapult. These two are, um, they're both dragon types. Um, okay, ha Hop, I'm gonna Ice Fang Gudra. You go into uh, Dragapult. Uh, okay, Zamazenta didn't take too much damage. Play Rock. Ah, uh, good try, Hop. Gudra's nearly down, though. Oh, come on. Good grief. Alright, um... Hmm. Do I Dynamax here? The sandstorm's doing us some good. I say we stay in and go for it. Come on. Zamazenta's fine. But burn. 
Awesome. Gudra dodged it? Oh my god. Alright, I took down Gudra. We might narrow this down into a one on one. <clears throat> awesome. Alright. Duraludon's up next. And I believe this turn. Yep. Right, we're gonna use jaw lock on uh right? Jaw lock? Yeah. Stand tall, Dreladon. Smash their hopes of winning pieces. Okay. This is interest this might not end well. Uh I don't know if we have a chance here, but we'll see. <clears throat> I mean, the sandstorm is nearly over already, right? All right, there goes Hop. Um, I am mighty concerned. Oh no. That did not do a lot of damage. Oh, but that boosted Dragapult's attack. Oh god. Jaw lock. Okay, that's not bad. Yeah, dang it. All right. For now, just defeat Dragapult. Uh-oh. He's not okay. Um, not good. We're fine. We're fine. I'd still love to have um, Dreadnought out to fight um, Charizard, but I guess that's not going to happen. Do I have anyone else who could go up against Char... A decent amount of my team is fine. That did good damage. And there goes the Sandstorm. Okay. We also still have our G-Max. Okay, it's Charizard. Alright. Let's try rock tombing Charizard. We're not gonna be able to go, but whatever. All right, there goes Hop. I don't think that was a smart Dynamax Hop. They should set the AI to not always do it. Hmm. There I go, yep. All right, that's the end of their G-Max. But now I have to take them both on alone after next turn. Oh! Okay, that was not bad. Let that raise, special defense, ugh. All right. So Charizard is going to use Solar Beam this turn. Oh, what to do, what to do, what to do. Um, hit Charizard. That's going after me. Yup. Yup. Okay, that takes down Dureladon now.
Boom. Drelodon is down. Alright. Potswick team is not going down yet. Here we go, Cinderace. Electro Ball. With the Libro ability. Boom. Ooh, that did decent damage. And there goes Rillaboom. Okay. That's the end of the Gigantamax. It's a one on one, Leon. Fire Blast. Oh no, wait, we're electric. Woo! Oh boy. Wait, we're using special attacks. That doesn't lower it. Electro Ball. Boom. We beat Charizard. Oh, that was a close match. Raihan and Leon were both defeated. <sighs> I fought on, on to the end and still lost. Well, that's the fine line long as I fit uh, to the end of next uh, of the match next time. That was a match that had fit right in the Champion Cup. Getting the Galarian Star Tournament up and running was definitely a good idea. Thanks again. All right. We have one. Let's go. Of course, B okay, I just noticed Bead and Clara teamed up. That makes so much sense. They're both stuck up people. Anyway. The Galar Star Tournament, I have to say, that was pretty fun. You were amazing. Thank you, both of you. Our new champion and our old one. All the matches were brilliant. Just waves a little bit. You hear that? Voices of Galar. The excitement we brought all these people. They can't help but be moved by that fantastic performance you just put on. Their hearts are crying out for more. In this glorious tournament that's brought so much fire to the people of Galar, well, its time is up. We have our clear winners. Though it's an awful shame to end it after all the fun it's been, which is why I'm pleased to announce the Galar Star Tournament will continue from this day on. Wait, what? You mean there will be more matches? That's the best news we've had all year. You can have as many tournaments in, in this multi-battle format as you can stomach. If you want, you can stick with the same partner or next time try something different. Well, get all the uh, strongest trainers in Galar region into the, this wild mix. And we'll run wild next time and the next and after every time after that. As long as trainers and Pokemon keep aiming for the top together. As long as our fans want to watch our battles, their hands sweaty and nerves uh, uh, and excitement will go on for thousands of years. We'll carry on forever. All right, let's go. Until we won, until we meet again. And let's have the Maximizers play us off. Oh, hey guys, don't play the credits again, please. That was long. <laughs> oh, yep. It's having me play the credits again. Because that's the full DLC. Like, that's the first time I've actually done a Galar Star Tournament, by the way. Um, so yeah. I'm not going to end off here yet, because I have, uh... We still have a bunch of Pokemon that we want to catch. So, yeah, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna let the credits play. I can't skip this. Uh, well, I did that. Um, like, I can't skip it. So, yeah. Why can't you skip the credits and... Whatever. I'm gonna uh, skip this. So, yeah, guys. I'll be back in a sec. Uh, okay. Uh, it's over now, I think. 
think. Are we good? I think we're good. Yeah. All right. The credits are over. Oh my god, that took forever. Oh my god. Yeah. All right. Something to commemorate my victory: a sport uniform and a million polka dollars. Um, all right. Ooh, it's Ball Guy. All right. Uh, take this ball for battling. A flame orb. Cool. Ooh, I actually needed one of those. Uh, for one of my battle tower teams. I, uh, I needed one of those. Anyway... Um, oops, that, I had YouTube shorts open, I was waiting. Anyway, here it is. All right, so let's head on over to Route 3. All right, Moto Stoke. So, if you're wondering what we're going to do for the rest of the episode, catch Pokemon. That's my plan. All right, Gallade, to the front of my party. My false swiper. Ooh, but before we go, I just remembered. Uh, remember a move. Uh, Gallade. Uh, remember Hypnosis. Replace Slash. Alright. Uh, no, no. Um, anyway. Time to check out, um, uh, sort like this. Alright. I'm gonna check a bunch of the Pokemon that can be found on this next route. Um, see if I've already got them in my Pokedex. Uh, Ma... Ma Champ. Um... Okay, okay, here's how we're gonna do this. By number. Okay, I've not restored Ma Chop. Link. Um, Mudbray. Nope. Uh, Hancham. Yeah. Okay. I've restored you to the Pokedex. Uh, color green. No green there. I have a spreadsheet up on my phone. Sizzlepede. Alright. Uh, H-I. Yep, Sizzlepede's already in there. Alright. Color. Green. There. Uh, alright. Uh, Cheruby. Um, nope, I've not gotten Cheruby in the Pokedex. I'll figure it out, you know? I'll, I'll figure it out as I go. <laughs> yeah, I have a, a spreadsheet on my phone that I created, and it basically holds the entire database of the route Pokemon. Have I not fought the trainers here? Oh my god, I'm such a loser. Anyway, uh, I caught a Gossip Blur already, right? Yeah, alright. Every Pokemon that I know I need to catch is on this list. Shoot, Tyro, get out of my face. Yeah. 
Ah, needed water. All right. Uh, yeah, some of these are random encounters, so we're just gonna have to. There we go. This is gonna be a lot of what we're doing. Kind of just going for it, you know? We're gonna be here a while. Ooh, Stunky. Have I captured Stunky? Have I? Have I? Have I? Uh, I have not. All right. Go, Pokeball. There. Two. Great. Yep, we caught it. Boom. Let's go. All right. All right. Um, next random encounter, Pancha. Hi. Oh, we have to go to a cherry tree. Cherry tree, a berry tree, and shake it a little bit uh, too much, and hope we get a Cheruby. Because that's a Pokemon we're going to need to catch. All right, what do we got here? What do we got? Pancham. Okay. Um, this is going to take longer than I thought. Um, hmm. Ah, shoot. I ran into this gossip floor. Uh, there are these things also called curry encounters, and I don't know how they work. Um, captured a sizzlepeed already. Also, how nice it would have been to know I could have caught a matcha, not a matcha, a clink here. I just got out of a battle, and you just spawn in and run into me. Thanks for that. I have limited time to record this video. Um. Yeah, this is going to be interesting. How would you guys feel about me turning off my music for some of these videos and just getting some other music to play? Like, would you guys be fine with that? I hope to find a shiny while doing this. That's my hope. I hope I find a shiny. I'd love to find a freaking shiny again. Because I've found two so far, and I'd love to find some more. Alright, um... Here we go, Machop. Alright. Pokeball, go! Oh, it broke out, okay. Then I'll have to use... Ah. Uh, uh, false swipe. Take this. Did you guys know that Ash is mo- Uh, not Machop. Ash once caught a, um... A Farfetch, and at one time lost after being hit by false swipe. And I'm like, how is this possible? It's not done yet. It's at 1 HP. It can still battle. That was just like, bruh. Is Ash really that bad? Oh my god. Anyway, uh, Machop has been caught. Uh, send it to the box. Alright, that leaves 
Link and Mudbray. I found another Moth Chop. Awesome. Uh, yeah, there are Pokemon I gotta catch everywhere. Um, yeah. Here we go. What's this? Another Pancham. All right. Yeah, I'm moving on. I'm moving on to find a berry tree. And then shake it a ton. All right. Hold up. Mudbray! There's one. All right, here we go. Quick ball. Have you guys heard about the whole quick ball argument? I hate it. Like, it's basically talking about whether or not we should use a quick balls or not on rare Pokemon. And I'm like, it's, it's easy, though. It is easy, though. All right, Mudbray. Hot. Okay, here we go. We need to find a berry tree. Uh, I can also find Clink around here, and I'm hoping I do. I'm also hoping to find a shiny, since I'm going to be encountering a lot. A lot of Pokemon. And when I say a lot, I mean a lot. Well, time to cream this child. I kind of feel bad. I, I kind of feel bad about doing this, but she leaves me no choice. It's just a tiny purloin. She's like, my dark type has an advantage against your psychic type. Oh god. Haha, <laughs> your defense has fallen, though. My next Pokemon will be able to beat you for sure. Oh, yeah. I'm so strong. Go, squub it. <laughs> I just look at her like, come on, girl. You know you're gonna lose. Dead. The squub it has died. I killed it. All right. Ah. 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 Oh. <gasps> oh, that hurt. Anyway. All right, shake the berry tree as much as possible. Shake it more. More. There we go. Cherubi, Cherubi, Cherubi. No! 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 Why do you gotta do this to me? Well, too bad. So sad. Time to move on. Oh, also, uh... Oh, they must have patched that. There was a thing you could do... Uh, previously, where you could, like, glitch yourself into a tree. I learned that one from Poke Tips. Um. Alright, there's a Pokemon. You know, I should probably check if I've... There are physical encounters I have to catch still. Bullpix, Growlithe, and Trubbish. But they can't be found in this area because only Roly Coly are visible encounters here. So let's move on. Oh, hello, sir. You're uh, you're um delivering letters of victory. I feel bad. I have to just crush all their dreams, and I have no choice. It's a deli bird. Oh, you know what? Never mind. I don't feel bad anymore. I had sympathy, not anymore. <laughs> Until it was all the same until the Fire Nation attacked. I don't know. 
Am I the Fire Nation in this case? Like... I don't know. It's weird. Alright. Um... Do, do, do. Trubbish! No! Get out of my face! Get out of my face! I see a Pokemon I need and you're just you're getting in my way! Stop smiling, you stupid child! Stop it. Psycho cut. Boom. Get on my face, you stupid little child. Haven't you had enough already? I just o code you with a Gallade. Just seize Gallade. Oh, crap. These guys really think they can beat me. They should go and forget it. Beat the one who lasts, laugh. Last laughs when I'm making my exits. It's only for the strong of heart, not even kidding. And no matter what the outcome, you better recept it. I can cut right through steel. I can bury the blade. So go down for a second. Just get out of my way. I can steal. I'm not letting it go. Cause take this as the lesson. Cause it's all that we know. Will the whole world know your name? Sorry. Had to. I had to do a bit of singing from Sonic Frontiers. I couldn't help it. Why did I do that? Frick! <laughs> and if you were wondering what that sound was, it was me dying inside. Um. Ooh, Vulpix. That was one I needed. All right. Oh wait, I've already captured Vulpix. Okay. Um, green. There we go. I've already captured a Stunky today. Uh, Mudbray, hello. By the way, guys, fun fact, I've actually memorized the lyrics to every single Sonic Frontiers uh, boss soundtrack sound song. Besides I'm Here, because um, I don't listen to that one as much, I kind of feel bad for beating the crap out of these children. <laughs> but only a little bit. Like, yeah, I only feel a little bad. Anyway. <clears throat> uh, ooh, Pokemon. Should I be going after these random encounters at this point? I don't think I need to. I don't think I need to. I'm going to check and see if I've caught a Clink already. Um, uh, starts with K. Clink. I've not caught a Clink. Interesting. Okay. Have I caught a Growlithe? Uh... Grubbin. Nope, I've not caught a Growlithe. Okay. Alright, what do we have here? Machop. Alright, um... If you guys comment for me to turn off the, um, the music and play something else, then I will. I... I personally think, like, this music will get very old very fast. As a matter of fact, I'm not even wearing my earbuds to listen to it. Um, yeah. 
can this Zigzagoon get out of my way, please? I I'm not trying to encounter it. Um, but yeah. <clears throat> Come on. Hi, Pancham. <clears throat> I think when completing the Pokedex, I'm gonna find a shiny. At some point, either in the wild area or in this area, I'm gonna find a shiny. Um... Hi, Tyrogue. What do you want? Oh, this is something I thought was weird. If you don't use an incense to, ha to get a Hitmonchan egg, you'll get a Hitmonchan that knows Vacuum Wave. Because it can only learn the move at level 1. And I'm just like, why on earth would Hitmonchan need to know Vacuum Wave? And also... Certain Pokemon shouldn't have that move. Lucario, I get it. It's a special attacker. It's a mix between physical and special attack. So I get it. Okay. Random counter. It's, uh, it's a Rookity. Cool. Um. Run from it. Oh my god. <laughs> This is so annoying. Clink! Here we go. I found one. Alright, let's false swipe it. I I'm curious as how much damage this will do. Still brought it down to one. That's pretty cool. I don't know why it can learn Vice Grip. It doesn't have hands. Now, Pokeball time. Alright. Clink has been caught. That's all the random encounters of this area. Alright, that leaves Cherubi in the cherry. The cherry tree, the berry tree. And Growlithe plus Trubbish for this route. Um... Anything else? No, not... Okay. This is gonna be interesting. Uh, how do you... I'm curious as to how a curry encounter works. I've never tried that before. I didn't even know that was a thing until I did research for this video. <gasps> Trubbish! Hi, Trubbish. People hate this Pokemon. I think it's cute. It's not one of my favorites, but it's... I don't hate it. I think it looks kind of cute. Like, look at that little derp face. Look, just look at him. He's a little poison type. Of course he's going to be a garbage bag. Oh my god, I remembered a MMJTV bit. Just like, let's take this type that we clearly loved, because we had 30 of them in one region, and make it trash. Oh, like a poison type that's a trash bag with eyeballs? That's a good idea. Table that for around lit around a decade. But no, I meant make it not good. Ah. Yeah, that's Trubbish caught. I need Growlithe. Um Past the Corvus Squire, there's nothing. It's at this point that I think we're just going to be waiting for Pokemon to despawn. And spawn in as something else. Ooh, item. Well, for now, let's just fight this trainer. Ah. <clears throat> 
a Vulpix. Hello there. Alright. Psycho Cut. Alright. There we go. Ah! Sorry, that's my dad. There. I, I had to respond to that, it was important. Um... Can I battle you? Oh! <laughs> I didn't know you could do that. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I didn't know you could do that until now. I kind of thought it was just a background Pokemon. Oh, it's level 18? Yeah, bye-bye. Um... Yeah, I went this way. I didn't collect this. I don't know why I didn't collect that. That was useful. Uh, yeah. I didn't see any other routes where you could find Cheruby. I did not see a single other route where you could do that. So that might be an issue. That might be a problem. Getting a Cheruby. Is then I'm going to have to come back here every single time I record, or just do it off camera. Uh, thank you for healing up my Gallade. Thank you so much, lady. Now, off I go. Um, all right. Uh, no Growlithe, huh? Any other place I can get one? Um... I ran into a Vulpix just now. <clears throat> anyway. Nothing. 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 Let me see if this... No, that didn't respawn. <sighs> Disappointment. Wait, if I just go off screen, they'll despawn, and then I can respawn them? That's interesting. Uh, oh my god. Hi, Machop. We're going to accidentally run into a lot of Pokemon. So I'm hoping that we're going to find Shiny. And that's actually why I want to do the main Galar decks first. Because uh, then we can get the Shiny Charm. Which will boost the shiny odds by a great deal. And that's when I plan on finishing out the max layer. Alright, go this way. Um. All right, back over here. Come on. Hi, Zigzagoon. Don't worry, you're not on the list. 
Um, yeah, my list consists of a bunch of people named Gary. Ah, uh, come on. Uh, yeah, how do I differentiate them on my list? Well, every person named Gary uh, spelled their name differently. So, yeah, that's, that's how I've been handling that. Hero, Jesus. What? Why? Uh, but yeah, you would have to... There's a bunch of weird stuff with Pokemon. To get a Riolu with Vacuum Wave, you need a, uh... A, um... A female Hitmonlee. Er, no. Chan, Hitmonchan. You need, you need a Hitmonchan and a Lucario to breed. Um, yeah. Where are these stinking Growlithes? I have found out off camera um that we are actually past the worst of random encounters we're past the worst of it not even kidding we, we have gotten through the worst of them which is fee bass because in the last episode we caught a wild fee bass which was such a hassle i was there for like an hour before we found our an actual... Before we found a Feebass, I was there for like an hour. I cut out half of it, and it was just like... I cut back in, and I found it. That wasn't even planned, by the way. I have to, to cut in my videos. I have to press a pause button on my OBS, which just pauses the recording for a little bit. So I planned on just coming back in after I found it. So, yeah, because I hate editing, and I'm the only person on my channel, I hate editing, so, yeah. I'm going to read a Sonic comic while we're here. Eh, let me back up a little bit. Um, Alright, we're reading issue 50 of Sonic IDW. Why would Eggman make such a big deal about su summoning all these bad nicks? Uh, the guy, the guy likes to make a big pre uh, presentation. Can't fault him for that. Uh, yeah, but doesn't it usually come with some kind of declaration? Uh, not too late to just sit this one out. No judgment. Because they're invading like Eggman's capital city. I don't. I know I can't show this on screen, but like, yeah. Sorry for that. Uh, thank you, but I need to see this through. All right, page. All right, now we're looking at Doctor Starline over here. Like clockwork, send word to Surgeon Kit and engage them in, uh, and engage them immediately. Surveillance has identified Sonic, Tails, and Bell on our... Oh, I read that wrong. Finally, after all the plotting, planning, and frustrations, my dream is finally coming to flourishion. My perfectly calibrated doppelgangers will destroy Sonic and Tails. My overwhelming army of badniks will blitz all global resistance, and then I can welcome Dr. Eggman to my side where he belongs. Excuse me, Doctor... You're in my seat. Destruction. Chaos. Uh, superlative entrance, sir. Immaculate. Nevertheless, I hoped to never... Uh, it would never come to this. Because you knew I would destroy you. No, sir. I didn't want to embarrass you. Bam! 
Sorry, I'm having too much fun here. <laughs> I'm going to out loud read this without you guys having any context as to what's going on. Uh, check out Silver Sonic or somebody who posts these comics on YouTube. Or just buy the comic yourself. That's what I'd first recommend you doing. Eggman is attacking his own city? No, I think he's fighting someone. Oh my gears and starters! That bad Nick looks like Sonic. Is that Metal Sonic? Yeah, somebody really messed him up. What's going on today? I'm gonna fix him. <laughs> I don't think that's a good idea. I couldn't save Moto, bud. I know I can't save every bad Nick, but I can't abandon a robot in need. I understand. Just be careful. He's dangerous. Um... You had me repair him after the whole Neo Metal Takeover thing, remember? Sonic the Hedgehog, issue, issue, tw issue 12. That was back when we thought Eggman was done and didn't know about Starloin. Plus, you de-weaponized him. He still had his metal claws and turbine torso. My point is... <laughs> Sonic, where'd you go? Ah! Tails! Yeah, uh... I know you guys can't see, but, like, you're having fun, though. I at least have something to say. Ah, oh, sawdust. <sighs> Alright. Next time I'll see if I can get this actually up on screen. Maybe I'll get scans of these and uh, put them up on my screen. But, like, you can see my frustration at the moment of not being able to find a stinking Growlithe. Am I sure it's a visible encounter? Um... Have I been wasting my time? Galar... Route... 3. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Pokemon. Uh... Let's see now. Growlithe has a 15%... Oh. I've been wasting my time. Yeah, uh, so Growlithe is a version exclusive. So I've kind of been wasting my time here. Whoopsie daisy. Uh, moving on. Just, just forget this happened. Forget this happened, okay? Forget this happened. It never happened. It never happened. Alright, here we go. Ooh. Since that Corvus Squire is back, I wonder. Nope. Um. Wonder if there's another place I can get Cheruby. But either way, into this dark, dingy cave. Um. I encountered a wild timber. I have not captured a timber yet. Alright, quick ball. Next time I'll have this up on my computer. If you guys want me to try streaming this, I will. I will try to stream this, but it might be buffery. I don't know. Last time I did streams, it wasn't very great. Anyway, Timber's data has been added to the Pokedex. Send it to the box. Alright, now for Woobat. I actually like Woobat. Woobat's a cute one. Actually, I think I've captured a Woobat. Yeah. Uh, Alright, let me label that. Alright. All right, Star Peak. There we go. Well, I found a Roly Coley. Ooh, while I'm here, I gotta talk to Oleana because she's in this location, isn't she? She'll give me uh, Chairman Rose's League card. Um. Looks like we're fighting a person. 
Honestly, like, my favorite character in the IDW Sonic comics is, like, e e Tangle Lemur. She's my favorite of the original characters, at least. And, like, y'all can't admit, you can't tell me you don't like Tangle. I think she's a great character. Alright. Uh. Anyway. Grab that. Heavy duty boots. An ether. Um. Stardust. Uh, Drillbur, here we go. Have I captured you yet? I remember using an Excadrill for a little bit in my, um, my Steel-type playthrough. I have not caught a Drillbur yet. I'll catch you real quick. Yeah, my Steel- the Steel-type playthrough was fun, I have to say. I- I think I ranked it wrong in my- in my ranking video. Because I had so much fun with that playthrough. I used eight Pokemon. Like, it was fun. It was fun. I don't know. Like, you know? Anyway. Um... Oops, ran into this timber again. Um, yeah. Run from the timber. Um, I can't believe I wasted so much time. Uh, really quick. I gotta just... Uh, yes! I encountered the charcoal! Let's go. Imagine how useful that would have been in, like... You can probably encounter it. Encounter one of them. Like the one at the end of the cave? You can probably encounter it. Like, imagine how useful it would be against the first gym, because it's, like, it's a fire... Er, uh, a grass-type gym. Like... Hi, ma'am. Anyway, yeah, we're gonna try to find Oleana while we're in here. I gotta mark off the Pokemon. Drillbur, caught. Charcoal. Uh, caught. There we go. That leaves Rog and Rolla in Diglett. So, yeah. Uh, have I not caught either of those Pokemon? I feel like I have. I'll check after this battle, but, like, I feel like I have. Anyway. Timber. All right. Psycho cut. All right, we defeated this timber. All right. Now I can move on with my life. Oh, there's Oleana. And the TM for Scary Face. Cool. Of course, that's where Oleana is. Because she has a scary face. Eh. Hang on. Oleana, I really want to talk to you, but it's hard. Oh, champion. Never thought I'd run into you in the mines. I've been doing some voluntary community service on Chairman Rose's behalf. Mr. Rose, a long time ago, used to work in a coal mine, you know. That's why I'm actually happy with doing this kind of work. Yes, I'm so happy. I think uh, I'll give you one of his prize league cards. 
You don't need to worry. I have a hundred copies of Mr. Rose's League card. They're all signed, too. That's something I have to work on. I have to make my League card. Um, yeah. We should probably do that sometime. Um. Oops, didn't mean to run into you there, Carcoal. Um. Didn't I catch a rock and roll already? Hold on. Uh, by letter. I'm gonna check Diglett first. I caught Doug Trio. I've not captured a Diglett. Okay. Um. Rog and Rolla. Yeah, I caught one already. Alright. That just leaves Diglett. Diglett. I wonder if this will do anything. Nope. Alright, well, I'll move on. I meant up. I said up. Why'd you go down? Ugh. Anyway. I'm currently doing a Pokemon Black and White playthrough. I'm actually using a Swoobat. Didn't mean to run into you there, Drillbur. Didn't have much of a choice, but didn't mean to do it. Anyway. Don't know if you guys, how you guys feel about this, but I'm pretty sure for any shiny, I'm kind of over odds. Just for a single shiny. Because my odds are currently like 1 in 4,000. Alright, there's Gallade. Up and at him. Got those sword arms. Alright. Yeah, I plan on doing all of Route uh, 4, and then ending the video. Oh. Oh, hey, I forgot this area existed. Rock Blast. That's pretty good. It's good to have. Alright. Um... Great Falls. Okay. Uh. Oh. I heard a diglet. Maybe I should get off my bike. There it is. Hi there, Diglett. I'm ready to fight you, but not really. I'm, I'm gonna catch you instead. Alright. Quick ball! Alright. Boom. Alrighty. All right, send Diglett to the box. All righty. Didn't mean to run into you there, Carcoal. So I believe that's this cave completed. Uh, yep. That is green. 
Mark that is. All right. All right. There we go. All right. So now, uh, yeah, we have Route Four to do. What's all on Route Four? A lot. Okay, maybe I won't do that today. Ooh. Um. Will I have Ch or Cherubi on this route? I don't know, but I'm gonna try. It's a squabbit. Hi, squabbit. Um, I'm gonna see if I can find Cherubi anywhere else. Um. Oh, everywhere. Like, everywhere. I might not catch everything here, but I'm going to catch a great deal of the Pokemon here. Like this milsery. There's a thing I wanted to do, but I forgot. Um, crit capture, let's go. <clears throat> oh, you know what? I just remembered um, an idea I had for a playthrough of Legends Arceus. I just remembered that, but I also kind of want to do it for Scarlet and Violet, but for the Scarlet and Violet version, I want to, uh, I want to do the DLC first before I do that. So, yeah. That's currently my plan. Alright, so I just caught Milstery. Uh, not slides. Um. There we go. I've already captured an Electric. Let's try to capture one of those Pumpkaboo. Here we go. All right, now false swipe won't work on it, so I'm just gonna quick ball it. Boom, 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 caught. All right. For physical encounters, that just leaves Eevee. Uh, I can catch a Goldeen by fishing. How many boxes have I already filled up? I'm just gonna check this out real quick. Um, box view. Nope. Um, oh, wait. Box list, here we go. I forgot how to do that for a minute. Wow, we have gotten box eight and we're still in the beginning of the game this is awesome uh i'm gonna check some of these pokemon real quick because i'm pretty sure i've caught some of these all right uh let's start with meowth yeah i've caught meowth uh there we go uh Badu. Um, I have not caught a Budu. Uh, Joltik. Um, Jellicent. Jolt Eon. Jolt. Yeah, nope, I have not caught a Joltik. Brah Seed. 
Um, I'm not caught for Ossied. Cutie Fly. Um, nope. And w I've, I've surely caught a Wooloo. Yeah. Alright. Couple of Pokemon to find here. Let's go find them. Wait. Eevee. Eevee, Eevee, Eevee. Hello there, Eevee. I'm Nick. I'm your trainer now. I actually have an Eevee plug in my room right now. Who doesn't love Eevee? Oh, here we go. I thought it was out of Pokeballs for a minute. <clears throat> Alright. Alright, Eevee has been caught. Now, send it to the box. Now, I'm not going to catch eight Eevee. That would take forever. You know, I actually like Valerian, yeah. You know? I really do. I think it's kind of derpy. I, I just I just like it. It's so derpy, you know? Anyway. Another Galarian, yeah. Um, there are four Pokemon I need to catch here. I've gotten all the visible encounters. Now it's just Joltik, uh, Seed, a couple others. Alright, there. Oh, hello, child. All right. Let's get sent out to Joltik. And yes, I know a bunch of these Pokemon can be found in the wild area. Yes, I know that. I know I can save myself a lot of trouble by doing that. But I choose not to. I choose not to. Okay? I don't know why. But it's just a thing. I choose not to. Anyway, hit this grubbin in the face. All right. Ah. All right. Now I have that. Run away. Run, 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 run. Man, these guys are fast. All right, Revival Herb, High Jolt, uh, uh, Electric. Holy crud, we've been going for a while. Another Milsery. Awesome. Yeah, doing random encounters like this is not easy. Like, especially here because of all these stinking electrics. Alright. This Gallade is pretty cool, though. Brossy. Here we go. Alright. Uh, let's use a nest ball. Trick capture, let's go. Boom. Alright. 
<sighs> um. Let's see now. Here we go, Joltik. Let's go. Uh, all right. Joltik, Brassi. One, two, three, hot. Okay. Next up, a Wulu. Alright. Um... Meowth, hi. <clears throat> I think I'll catch the only Pokemon in Turf Field as well, because why not? Um, like, there's only one Pokemon I can catch in Turf Field, and that's Crawdon. The only encounter. Come on. Dang, we're not getting many Pokemon here. <sighs> um Not getting many of the ones that we need. Uh Galar route. Hang on. Four. Um. Frost seed was the only one percent, and how did I find that one first? But it was four percent. And Cutie Fly is 5%. Why is it 5%? That is low. I say we stick to these fields. These fields are nice and clear of trainers now. So I say we stick around here. It's possible to find, um, anything else? Um, nope. All right, only random encounters then. We need a Budu, which is a 4%. And a cutie fly, which is a 5%. Those are abysmal odds for such weak Pokemon. Um. Oh, come on. You know, at this rate, I should find a shiny. With the rarity of, like, finding some of these, I should find a shiny at some point. So I'm going to take a cut, and I'll be back in a sec when I catch both of them. Right after... Oh, no. I found Cutie Fly. How to catch it. Uh, Cutie Fly. Go. Nope. Now just find Badu. Back to pause. Oh, finally. Finally, finally, finally. Finally, I was here 
for a while. I think it's been like 15 minutes. 15 minutes later, and I've finally caught this Badu. And now I, uh, I don't know what to do with my life. Uh, oh yeah. Mark it off. Uh, no nickname. Send it to the box. Alright. Oh. Um. I'm almost done with this route. I just have to go fishing. Ooh, a sharp beak. That'll be useful. Anyway. Time for some fishing. Again. I wonder how often these Goldeen will appear. That's a Choodle. Uh, how, um, how often is Goldeen going to appear? Uh, Goldeen has a 10% chance, so 1 in 10. That's not bad. Compared to, like, the 70% for Magic Carp. Like, yeah, that's, that's not great. Back up. Go back. Here we go. My magic garp, 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 garp. Stupid magic garp. It's just sitting there, bouncing around, being stupid. Magic garp's a weird Pokemon. I don't know how I feel about him. A little interesting. The most memed on Pokemon of all time, magic garp. Come on. Another Magikarp. Oh man, I'm gonna be here all day, aren't I? Last time it was Bass, and this time it was Budu. I actually found another cutie fly before I found that Budu. Um. Yeah, anyway, more fishing. Another Magikarp? Really? The chances of finding Magikarp around these parts are 70%, 20% for Choodle, and 10% for uh, Goldeen. That's literally quite much a 10% chance. So I f after I find another Choodle, I should soon find a Goldeen. Right? I should find it within 10. Although I've been sitting here for quite a while. Um. Come on. Get over here, Goldeen. I need ya. I believe this is my fifth Magikarp. Although, I'm not that good at mental counting. So, 6th encounter, 5th Magikarp. Um, come on. Alright, 6th Magikarp, 7th encounter. So now... The next one will be my 7th. Statistically, I should be getting close. Come on. Alright, 7th Magikarp. 8th encounter. I should be close. It's kind of like how Horsey Games should have found a Shiny Shaman by now. If he hasn't, by the time this video comes out, I don't know. It cur currently it's March 11th, and yes, I record these videos. Yes! Finally, that one was not that bad. I record these videos um, very early. I'm actually currently on spring break, so it's going to become a little earlier than this. But either way, we finally made it to Turfield, and I have one Pokemon to catch there. 
And that being that that one being fraud on. Alright. Boleen has been caught. Alright. Uh, that's Route 4 done. So now, we just have to... There's one more Pokemon that I need to catch around these parts. Uh, that one being over this way. There he is. Brought on. Hi. How are you doing? It's the only Pokemon that can be found here. Thus, I've... Oh, I've already caught it. That means I completed this death already. Alright. So. Oops. Uh... Really quick, I'm going to just fly over to Route 3. Uh, and see if that tree is back. Um, nope. Okay, well, that's sad. Anyway, we have gotten to Turfield. I'll have to do more berry trees later. But for now, I'm going to end off. So, yeah, guys. That's going to end this video here. Our Pokedex is now at 168 Pokemon. So, yeah, guys. I'm going to end off here. If you enjoyed, remember to like, comment, subscribe, turn on notifications, share this video with everyone you know and love. And I will see you all later. Bye.